I wanted to do a little update on a video I posted a couple years ago. I was building my main bench. I was using wax and boiled linseed oil as my finish. I wanted to show you what it looked like now after much, much use. Really helps. The other thing that I did was I did actually a really good finish on these uh, plywood. Um, just the raw plywood didn't seem right, so I took some linseed oil and some paraffin wax and melted it over the stove top. And then what I did is I rubbed it in as best I could and then took a scraper and scraped it all down right back to the wood. Once I let that dry I went back over with uh, some boiled linseed oil and a couple coats later and it seems good. I mean uh, you know a little paint on there will scrape right off and now at least it's not on raw wood. Alright now here it is two years later and I think it looks almost like it did when I Put it together a couple of years ago. Uh, Any time that anything drops on it, it simply wipes away, whether it be glue or paint or water. Actually, now it's two years later. Let's do a little demo. So I'm just going to find a random spot. Going to take this bottle of water and drop a few drops on there. Let's see what it does. It should just uh, beat up like the uh, water on a duck's back. And it doesn't seem to be what I drop on there. It seems to beat up pretty good. And I'm just going to wipe it down and it's that easy. You have enough wax and linseed oil, nothing will stick. Let me show you one more time. If I drop the water, it just sort of beads up. It doesn't soak into the wood. Okay, so if you're in the process of putting together a workbench, uh, you might want to try my technique of melting some paraffin wax with some linseed oil, either in a slow cooker or on a pan, nice and slow. Uh, I let it dry and then I went back a week later, soaked it with the linseed oil, gave it overnight and then just wiped it down and it's really lasted all these years, uh, two years later. Uh, I just thought to myself that this is probably a good time to maybe re-up the linseed oil once just to kind of keep that slick finish. I mean, it, it, it's, it's just like it's a Teflon coating. So, so hopefully this inspires you. You can make your own version of it, but if you're putting together a workbench or thinking about how to finish the top, that might be the best option for you. So again, thanks for watching this quick update two years later on my workbench, and you guys have a great day, and thanks for watching. This is Chris Demetric from TDW Woodworks.